What's up guys, it's Motorco here, and in this video I want to do a fun video. Um, uh, this is not anything serious. Um, I've been playing like crazy on the Japanese server the last couple of days, trying to get Cloud's Hall of Fame done. Uh, I, I, I've managed to, to do it. Uh, I'm successful in my um, attempts. There's um, there's still more to do, but I, I basically I got all, all of everything that I needed to get done done to be able to finish Cloud. So what what is Hall of Fame? I, a lot of people are probably asking that and probably wondering. Um, this is like a year down the road, guys. So like don't take this too seriously. Um, basically, what Hall of Fame is is there's these different nodes. Every node has a corresponding class. And each node unlocks a different branch of objectives for your class. Now, you have to have your class equipped and in the main job and the sub job to be able to go through and do these nodes. Um, and there's all kinds of different objectives. This particular objective, uh, I know you can't read this, but I've already translated it. It says, I have to defeat uh, eight enemies with weakness element. Um, so that means I have to figure out a way to kill eight enemies with the, the weakness. And then this, uh, bonus node up here will unlock and I can continue on. And, you know, basically once there's, there's locks every node. Okay. Now the rewards inside the chest are these special little cards that you can get. And there's a custom panel where you can customize, uh, your job. Okay. And this, this is the custom panel right here. It, it's not, it has nothing to do with your regular panels. There's no, there's no bonus panels. Your regular panels are still the same, but there's like a bonus custom panel where you can get these special little cards, um, by farm, just doing your regular farming and stuff. They'll, they'll drop it at some point. And every one of these little, these little tabs right here ha has a bonus ability. Okay. And basically what they've done with the Hall of Fame is they said, okay, well, we'll give you special sp class specific ones that you can only equip on this particular class and make them super powerful. And that's basically what they've done. And, and so these bottom four right here, one, this, uh, these bottom four um, all along the bottom row are all cloud specific um, ones. And, uh, the one on the right is the one that gives me plus 50% to all of my stats. Uh, I don't know what this, the second one does. I'd have to look it up. Um, the, the third one right here does plus hundred percent crit, uh, crit damage. And then the one on the left is plus 250% earth, uh, 250% earth. So my auto abilities change based off of that. Now I have 290% earth. And, um, as you can see, I have plus 200% crit damage up. Um, so I have a, t a ton of crit damage up, um, as Cloud using his weapon. And so my crits hit super hard. Um, so it's really, it's really, really nice in terms of damage, especially when you have uh, a multi-hit spell. Um, and I'll show you that here in just a second. So what I want to try and do is... Just show you show you the difficulty level of these nodes. These nodes are pretty hard. Um, I've had to use Phoenix Downs uh, a couple of times on them to get this done. Um, let me turn auto mode off. Apologies. So uh, yeah, as you can see here, um, I need to be able to do ice. So let's get this taken care of as you can see these guys hit extremely freaking hard um so this is not easy and anybody who says it's easy uh is kidding is kidding themselves either that or they have max cards or something like that they have something going for them um to be able to make this uh not as challenging i don't have any of that stuff uh, a lot of my cards are not complete yet um, I'm still working on them, so um, this is not as easy for me uh, as it might be for some other people. So that's two enemies out of the way with the weakness element that I was able to do. 
Um, I got to kill these guys with Earth somehow. Uh, I I don't know how the heck I'm going to manage to do this. Um, I might just have to, like, the problem is this Atmos card that I have is damage cap, so, like, I can't nuke. That's not a real viable strategy, unfortunately. But anyways, I'm probably going to die here. If I, if I do, that's fine. Uh, I'm not going to continue. You can see these, these nodes are very hard. Even with a maxed out already Hall of Fame cloud. So I have a lot of work to do on his cards and things to get them ready for this. Uh, but, you know, at least I have them done. Um... So that's kind of what the Hall of Fame is in a nutshell. Um, I'm stuck on the mage one. The The mage one is um, is right here. These are the first batch of Hall of Fame jobs uh, that you can do. I think there's like Hunter, White Mage. All kinds of different ones. Um, I'll show you right here. So this is what I'm talking about. There's different classes here. Um, I don't know what the class this is. But uh, yeah, this is the mage one that I'm on right here. And I have to get um, a hit that is greater than 250,000 damage. Which might seem easy on a mage. But when you don't have the water bonus, uh, when you don't have the water bonus on the mage just yet, it's not, uh, it's not as easy as it seems. Um, I think this is like the hunter one and then there's like the warrior one right here and all kinds of different stuff. But anyways, that's, that's kind of what the hall of fame is in a nutshell, guys. Hope you enjoyed this video. I'll get you some, uh, possibly get you some cloud gameplay, maybe do a, do it on a stream or something and just kind of have some fun, um, here on my next video. Um, hope you guys enjoyed the content. I know I haven't been making a lot of videos lately. Uh, I've been busy trying to get things done inside the game and uh, in preparation for the new events coming out as well as grinding out the Japanese version to try and show you um, some of the more future content that's coming and try and stay ahead of the curve. Um, so anyways, uh, I'll see you guys next video.